Howdy, howdy, howdy. My name is Anachi Sasuke, and welcome to Song of the Deep. So, this is a game by Insomniac, Insomniac Games, dudes who made uh, Ratchet and Clank, and I believe the original Spiral games. Please make some remakes of those, by the way. So, let's push the stop button. Yeah, options. Turn the music down just a little bit. Turn on the subtitles. Full screen. V-Sync unlocked. I'm not sure what that means. Okay, let's back it up. And let's get it started, shall we? Ouch. I assume intermediate is uh, normal, so let's do that. I don't trust myself to play it on the hard difficulty from the start. Marin loved the sea. She loved the sound of the waves calling to her through her window. She dreamt every night of the mysteries that lay beneath. Her father was a fisherman. Each day he went out to sea, and each night Merrin waited at the rocky cliff edge, holding up a candle to guide him safely home. The two of them were poor. Their roof was leaky, and they sometimes went hungry. But as long as they had each other, Merrin knew they would be okay. At night, her father sang her songs about his great adventures. He sang of giant leviathan serpents, haunted caves, and a lost city of gold beneath the sea. Marin knew the stories weren't real, but she loved to listen to them. She drifted off to sleep, imagining the wonders of the world below. And her life continued that way, simply and happily. Until one night, her father didn't return. Marin held up her candle at the cliff's edge all through the night, staring out at the empty sea. She shivered in the cold wind as she watched from all the next day. Her eyes welled with tears as night fell again and there was still no sign of her father. At last, she collapsed into sleep. In her dreams, she saw him, trapped deep beneath the sea, calling to her for help. She awoke with a jolt. A desperate and dangerous plan was already forming in her head. She took scraps of metal and wood her father had caught in his nets and pieced them together. She hammered and bolted, she measured and sawed. And before the sun had set, she had built a tiny, rickety submarine. With trembling hands, she squeezed inside and dove down beneath the waves to search for her father. That was some beautiful music. Also, I just want to say that I probably shouldn't have said the guys that made the uh, Spyro games, because I'm sure different people made those games. The publisher was Insomniac Studios, or whatever they call themselves. Studios? I think it's Studios. I don't know. I Insomniac. But that does not mean that the Sunset Overdrive people made this game, because that'd be kind of wacky. Sonar can reveal things. Oh, sometimes a lock is rusted shut with the worst course of action is to... I, I read that so badly. I'm gonna I'm stop. Something I should point out. I haven't actually given this game a test run to see if it runs like I meant to. Or rather to see if my computer can do it. So it's looking like it's gonna be laggy. And I really should have tested this first. So. If it's... If it gets to the point where the lag is too much, then I won't do a full series of this. I'll just do the one episode, but I do want to play the game all the way through because it seems interesting. So, just saying now, it's going to lag, and I'm sorry. And I... Hmm. I feel like it's supposed to be going through here, but it's pushing me back. So maybe I'm supposed to go around? No, that's, that's, that's why I came in. Fish, what do I do? The world beneath oh. the waves shimmered with mystery. Glow kelp bulbs lit up around her as she passed by. Glow kelp. Ooh, it starts glowing with my path instead of just all, ooh, bunny. Baron spotted some odd looking old coins. Maybe her father would know where they were from. 
I hear I hear some twinge of uh, Scottish in there. I don't know if that's the I'm not sure if that's the right uh, country or accent that I'm thinking of. Scottish. I'm not I'm not Scottish. I don't want to try to do Scottish and do a disservice to actual Scottish people like the narrator. Yeah. No money, money. Okay. Ah, ah, ah. Okay. I got all of them. Oh, a door of some kind. But how do I open it? I guess I need something. Maybe it's this way. An eerie light Ooh. flickered and danced on the sea floor, like an underwater fire. Her oh. father once told her about a mysterious living energy called time. Could that have been a time wellspring? That's an interesting way to handle the checkpoints. Don't do the thing. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, no, no, no! Okay, I gotta time that then. Okay. Oh! Up, 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 up! Okay, I don't go up, I just go through. Mush! No! No! Okay, I just gotta go straight through when nothing's happening. And then I'm gonna get that coin. I'm gonna get that coin. Go, 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 go! Yeah! No! No! Fight it! Fight it! I don't even know if this is the way I'm supposed to be going. I feel like it might be the way I'm supposed to go. So let's just go. No. Okay, okay, okay. Go, go, go. Don't I have some kind of, like, jet? Okay, I'm going to try going a different direction. Maybe I can ram a wall. Okay, I cannot ram a wall. So I do have to go that way. Alrighty then. Oops, Daisy. Pelvic thrust! Ah! This is a really, really sturdy submarine to have not been destroyed by now. I did it! A seahorse made of clockwork gears darted out of the way as Marin approached. She wondered who could have built such a curious creature. Probably, uh, probably that underwater city of gold. Can I get up here? Should I get up here? No! Okay, I got the freaking coin. No. Damn you. Okay. Go, go, go. Duh. Okay, okay. Okay. We're going to make it. We're going to make it. Go. Now, do I swim up? Follow the seahorse! I missed one. Oh, I guess not. That thing's screaming at me. What is that? MAGNETIC CLAW! A versatile magnetic claw capable of grabbing, pulling, and attacking. Marin approached a glowing scrap of metal and pulled it inside. It was claw-shaped and had a strong magnetic pull. She took out her tools and attached it to a firing mechanism on her steering column. How was that a thing she thought to put onto her steering column? Okay, let's... Grab!
Wait, wait. Uh. Okay, so we're trapped then. Oh, I can... Oh. Okay. Wait. Am I over here again? It was a shortcut, too. Boom. A glorious, glorious shortcut. Into its face. Why do you scream? Why do you scream? Is that is that the same thing or is that something else? Okay, you just you just stay just like that. I'm pretty sure this is the thing again. It is the thing again. No, screw this. Okay, we're going to try to go the other way. Unless, 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 I'm supposed Aaron to go back. Aaron spotted shock nettles ahead of her. She had to be cautious, as the hostile creatures would attack her on sight. No! How do I aim it? No! Stop that! Leave me alone! Dude, really? Get out of here! Yeah! Burn in hell! Now there's another one! I'll destroy you! I just, I just gotta open this door. Open this door! Get out of here. Get out of here! Saying that just makes me think of, uh, there was a point where I was heavily binging Game Grumps episodes. The claw also damages dudes. If I can damage them with the freaking claw! That does not look like damage. That is not, that is not how damaging enemies looks. Like, I don't know who told them what damaging enemies looks like. Okay, so anyway. I was watching a Dennis the Menace episode, and there was just something that made him just be like, get out of here! And it was hilarious, and I keep meaning to go back and watch it, but oh god. I did not realize that was going to do the boom. Heal me, weird mystical floor light! Oh, it did! A sleeping guardian blocked Meryn's path. She knew it all too well from her father's stories. And she knew it must never be woken. A sleeping guardian. Well, what? How do? I, how? How do I know if it wakes up? It's awake! It's awake! It's awake! I'm not even over there anymore. Please stop. What am I carrying? How am I carrying light itself? Why have I been allowed to do such things with Merlickety Submarine? Also, how am I supposed to get past the Guardian if he must never be awoken? Do I have to shoot the bombs back? Look at me, maggot! Destroy! According to her father, the Guardians had been built by ancient undersea explorers, called the Fomori. Marin always thought the Fomori were a myth. Now she wondered if her father's other stories might be true. And I wonder what stories those are. I'm pretty sure you get the stories if you, uh, if you buy the physical edition for the Xbox One or the PS4, but 
that is not what I'm playing right now. I am playing the PC version that I got in a humble bundle. Well, that is lag. Lag, 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 lag. Okay. Let's go down here. Spoopy music. Computer, relax. Computer, don't have a cow, man. Oh, the Undying Caves. What is that? Do I destroy you? Do I destroy you? I will! I will! Well, that's never coming back. What are you? Is that bones? That looks like a space pirate. The old statue reminded her of her father's lullabies about the brave and beautiful Marrows. Oh, this is probably supposed to, uh... <clears throat> Let me just... Can you just... Can you just... Can you just... I just want to put this down! Okay. Oh, I'm here! Yeah. Another save point! Oh, I probably have to throw something at that. I probably have to go get something to throw at that. What's down here in the depths? It also damages enemies. Well, I don't see any enemies. I just see some fish. Fish! What are these enemies that you're telling me about? Can I grab this thing? I cannot grab that. I don't see any enemies. Or am I going to get enemies when I pick up this head here? I need this. I apologize. It brought enemies! What is that? What is that? That didn't work. Did I get it? Ah. How many of these things are there? Oh, I had to bring that head to, to this statue. Ah! Put the head on the thing, put the head on the thing, put the head on the thing. Get, I'll beat you! Is the head on the thing? Destroy! Okay, it's open. As Marin explored, she sketched the terrain on a sheet of cartography paper. Ah. Her father had taught her that those who make maps are never lost. That sure is a map, and oh, there's a big old X where I'm supposed to be going, because I get that you're never lost if you make a map, but that doesn't mean you just know what's down here. Hey, a starfish. Let's throw it at the brick wall. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to work. What are you guys? Afraid. A huge hermit crab watched Merrin from a rocky ledge. On his back, he carried a vast array of odd-looking treasures. Yo, let the me crab buy something. seemed to like shiny objects. Maybe he would be willing to make a trade. Magnet collector. Well, I can almost afford that. Right, that's the B button. I'll be back with two more coins, Mr. Crab Dude. Hey, there they are. The map will always have a marker for your destination. I'm going to buy the thing now, Mr. Krabs. Gimme. Using the materials she bought from the hermit crab, Marin took out her tools and made a quick modification to her magnetic claw. You're gonna get the clamps! What is that? What are you? That looks important. I better find a way to get in there. No, my money! Oh, hey, more money. And one of these heads. Do I have to launch the head at the wicker? Launch! Yeah, I, I don't know what I thought that was going to do. So where does this head go? 
There doesn't seem to be a head map. Oh, okay. I'm really not. I'm really not sure what I thought was going to happen there. Must launch head. Is there some sort of other way to get in there? Because it looks like the head is just going to sort of bounce back. Go! Yeah, I don't know. Uh, let's swim up and see if I missed something. No, no, wait, wait. Is this the way? Map, am I going the right way? I'm going, okay. Yeah. Get out of here. Ah! What the crap? Ah! My spleen! Whew. Okay. Uh. Okay. That happened. What's that? Are you another enemy? Are you another enemy in disguise? The save point. And some more money. What are you? Are you enemy? Are you gonna help? Are you enemy? Are you gonna help? Are you are you are you, are you helping? Do you want something? Okay. Do you want this thing? Oh hey! It's another thing that needs a head. Are you what needs the head from before? Cause if I gotta bring that head all the way up here, that's kinda... First... Let's see if this dude's hungry. What is that? Oh! Okay then. So let's save again. And then let's go back for that head. Let's go get some head, y'all. Ha ha ha! Look at me, my grown self, and my mature jokes about dicks! The powerful current was too strong to cross. Meryn's submarine would need greater thrust before it could go back. Saying that immediately after the really bad dick joke, I, um. Hmm. We need greater thrust of our wang dang doodle noodles. Wait, so if I don't have the thrust to go forward or back, what am I supposed to do? I mean, I understand that this is basically a Metroidvania game with boats, but I need a head for this for this dude, and I didn't bring one. So maybe I'm supposed to keep feeding the, the thing? Yes, yes, the current is too strong. I would need greater thrust. Greater thrust! Okay. So far, the only button that actually seems to do anything is the analog stick and the, uh... The X button. Do you want more things? Do you do you want more things? Or do, aha! It looks like there's a head here. There's not though. I thought there was something there. Okay. You know, I probably should have saved the title Lagtastic Voyage for this game instead of blowing it on, uh, uh, Breath of the Wild. But yeah, I need a glowy fish head for this, and the glowy fish head is back in the direction where I cannot go without greater thrust.
So, if I can't go that way, everything requires greater thrust, and I don't have it. And I have some sort of lightning bolt thing. What does that do? Contr uh, controls? There's not controls. Okay. So I'm supposed to be going that way, but I can't because I need a head, which is back that way, where I can't go. Ugh. <sighs> I guess I can see if it wants to eat more shells. You want to eat more shells, dude? Yeah, it's a no. There's gotta be something. They wouldn't just put this here with no way to give it a head, would they? They wouldn't really do that. There's, if there's no way to backtrack, and no way to go forward. Oh! It's one of those. But the thrust, the thrust, okay. No, wait, wait, go up, 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 up. Go, 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 there's the head! There's the head! Okay, wait, right here. Go! Go! Get the head! Ha ha! Now, where am I? Oh, man. Can you not? I'm in the middle of something! Are there any more spiky dudes? Or can I go now? What is that? That looks important. I'm gonna get it. Okay, where does this go? Or is it a boom? Go! Okay, it's not a boom, so I'm going to send it forwards, just in case. Fly! Let's get the head. Okay, and up here is where the head needs to be. And then I think we get the greater thrust. Okay. 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 Boost jet. A sophisticated propulsion device capable of boosting the sub's movement in short sprints. Amidst the wreckage of an old Fomori vessel, lay an undamaged propulsion device. Marin bolted it onto the back of her submarine, eager to test out its effects on her lightweight craft. <laughs> I will destroy you all! Ow. Ow, ow, ow. My soul. Okay, now. Uh, hey, I, 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 I see you. I see you. <laughs> okay, so definitely supposed to be going back. What happens if I boost in the face? Go, go, go! Okay, nope. So we gotta get all the way down there, and then we gotta boost! BOOST! Okay, here we are. Let's save the game. And I think I'm gonna stop here. So Stop it. This has been Nachi Sasuke. This was Song of the Deep. In the next episode, I guess we're going to try to find a way to break through some more walls, find some more heads, give said heads, and yeah, it should be a good fun time full of more lag. 
maybe I can do something about that. I doubt it. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Later!